Assuming that you've all heard of the streaming service Netflix, I'm just going to jump straight into the story. I don't use the service much anymore, and for a pretty good reason. You see I live in the UK, and there's not much to watch on the UK Netflix in terms of TV shows, in comparison to the Canadian or US Netflix. I found out that there was a way to access the Netflix in countries, by typing a DNS code manually into your device. After a short time searching around, I came across a website that included hundreds of DNS codes that users had uploaded for the Canadian and US Netflix. Jackpot. I thought to myself. Without a second thought in the world, I picked the first DNS code I saw and typed it into my Xbox settings. It didn't work. I tried code after code and had no luck. What's the point of a website like this existing if none of the codes even work? I kept thinking. I kept scrolling and searching the site for codes, then diverting my eyes and hands to my Xbox to type in the code with no luck, until eventually, I came across a code on the 12th page of the site, it was right at the bottom and it was uploaded anonymously. Having already been searching for nearly 20 minutes, and about to give up, I decided this would be my final attempt before I called it quits. I typed in the code, and to my surprise, it, it worked. My Xbox restarted and no less than two minutes later, I was browsing the US Netflix. All the shows and movies I had been dying to watch on Netflix, finally able available to me. The next day, after a hard day of working, I came home, and the only thing I wanted to do was sit down and watch some Netflix. I turned on my Xbox, opened up Netflix and sat down. As I scrolled down to my watch list, to finish off season 2 of Breaking Bad, I saw there was something else in my recently viewed list, something I don't ever remember watching. The title of it was 6,233,564,242, and the image was just a red rectangle, as opposed to a still of the show or movie like other stuff on Netflix. Curious as to what it was, I did something that I will never stop regretting. I hovered over it, and tapped the A button on my controller. At first, it was just the color red covering the screen, before the image of a bath of its head began to fade into the center of the screen, it got bigger, and bigger. Until I jumped out of my seat, as a large screeching noise blared out of my speakers, and images of mutilated bodies, animals being tortured and people being abused flashed across the screen. This went on for about 30 seconds, and the sound of screaming got more and more intense, and then, darkness. My Xbox turned off, as did all the lights and electricity in my house. I sat there in darkness, hauntingly dwelling on what I had just witnessed, I began to cry, and try to hold because the vomit I could feel in my esophagus. After managing to pull myself together and stop the tears, I weakly stood up, venturing downstairs into my electronics cupboard. I managed to turn the power back on, and I ran upstairs to my Xbox, the Netflix app, had been deleted from my hard drive. I later discovered that my DNS code had been switched back to automatic. I had no idea what the hell had happened, and how it had happened, and the worst thing was, there was nobody there to witness my ordeal, who would even believe something like this? I know for sure I wouldn't. I searched for the website where I got the DNS code to report it, and speak to a moderator, but it was gone. I searched Google, Bing, and even good old Yahoo, nothing. I looked for hours but it had disappeared. The site was gone. I decided it was a good idea to write about the horrible episode in the actual Netflix forums, so I made an account hastily, and made a thread asking people if they had experienced anything similar to what I had, when entering a manual DNS, without detailing everything I had saw in the video. I refreshed the page to see if anyone had replied, only to get an error 404, saying that the page didn't exist, my thread had been deleted within a few minutes. This was all unsettling, but not as unsettling as the main thing. The main thing that sends shivers down my spine, something it took me weeks after this experience to realize. The title of the quote-unquote show, 6,233,564,242. It was, it was my IP address.